Welcome back to Peace, Love and Tarot. This reading is for Scorpio, Sun, Moon and Rising and it's the weekly reading for the week May 13 to 19. So your cards this week, Scorpio, energy is leaving, completing or transitioning. You have the Three of Pentacles clarified with the Ten of Swords. Focus energies, you have Justice with the Ten of Cups. And towards the end of the week, you have Judgment with the Page of Wands. Interesting stuff going on this week, Scorpio. I strongly feel that this is related to a third party situation. So this will only obviously resonate with a, a certain amount of you, but um, it's definitely looking that way from the cards here to me. So we have the, the Three of Pentacles here. You know, you built something together as, a, um, as three parties, three individual parties. Um, but uh, this really is coming to a completion um, right now, pretty much, if not, um, it's already in progress. So the Ten of Swords, you know, talks about that strong completion energy and completion of something that um, has basically worn you right out, made you feel fatigued and even stabbed in the back. So it's likely that, um, you know, you're the person either walking away from this or the person that's been hurt by this. Um, I strongly don't feel that you're the person sailing off into the sunset um, with, with whom you hope to. So situation is transpiring, it's coming to completion, but you know, it, it's the right time for that and it absolutely had to. Um, it really didn't have that sustainability to move forward into a prosperous, happy, long-term relationship. So uh, folks' energies, we have the justice with the Ten of Cups. So justice is being served on, on love this week. So justice comes in when a fear and just modification needs to happen. And when justice comes in, it always works out in favour of, um, you know, how it is meant to, whether that seems fair for um, whoever party, you know, the party is involved, it will work out in a fair and just way. The scales will always balance, the universal balance sheet always, um, always adds up. And I also see this as, as you with your, you know, picking up your sort of power. This is you also saying, look, you've had enough. I'm not standing for that. I deserve more. I'm not going to be that third wheel anymore. I deserve my Ten of Cups. I deserve my happy ever after, my happy ending. I deserve all my cups filled up, all the emotional um, well-being and harmony. And, you know, the home and the partner and the pets. And, you know, this is what you deserve. And you're not settling for this anymore. This was a waste of your time. It wasn't going anywhere. So this week you're picking up your sword of power. Um, quite likely, if you know it hasn't already sort of come to pass, this is where you're going to actually cut things off and say, you know what, I'm moving in my own direction and I deserve love, I deserve the Ten of Cups. So towards the end of the week, judgment with the Page of Wands. So judgment, you know, this is your last call. It's that last call of the past and the future coming together. It's really your final decision time, you know. There could be the temptation to sort of go back in this because no doubt there was, you know, some feelings and, you know, possibly even love feelings. So judgment sort of says, you know, are you going to stay or are you going to go? Um, and also, you know, can be the card of forgiveness. So uh, if you decide to move on, you know, forgiving and forgetting can be... Um, really critical because it can help you move on quicker and I do feel like you will be moving on and you know you're probably feeling very vulnerable just like these people here you know the situation has probably left you feeling really exposed especially if you're the person sort of walking away and um, you know it's possible that um, you know you in another relationship as well and your partner's even potentially found out about this and you're the one you're the one feeling vulnerable but, you know, it's all coming to a head and you're doing the right thing by resolving it this week. Page of Wands here. Um, you know, I know that you're not a fire sign and Wands is a fire card, but I strongly feel like this is you set free. This is you moving towards the light, leaving the situation of darkness and moving towards a new beginning. You know, Page of Wands is about exploration and discovery and being a free spirit. This is you being able to tap back into your freedom energy again after sort of being bound and pinned down and literally stabbed in the back by this situation. This is the time that you look over your shoulder and you say, you know what, see you later, 
I'm going this way <laughs> and that's exactly what you're going to do. Good luck with it Scorpio, it's all coming to a head this week for you, it's all going to work out, you deserve the Ten of Cups and it, that um, energy is here too, it's sort of showing you what you could have um, in the future. Um, just keep in mind yeah, this is a general reading, I don't feel this is going to resonate, obviously not every Scorpio is going to find themselves in this situation this week, but a few of you are and this one is for you guys and we'll see you for another reading next week.